Okay, so we have Fuego in game on JP. So this is basically gonna count as an early showcase. I will show him in the new content being frame challenge. So um, this is gonna be serving a bit as a damage test, even if he's not a perfect Fuego yet, while also being able to just show his animations. But we're gonna go over his stats, right? So he's fully in game, right? JP, sorry, global at the time of posting should be getting him in three hours at 8 a.m. EST. If you want the exact conversion time, you could go to the official discord and check the discord events the discord links down below you can also check my discord out if you want to see the leaks early but i will be posting the info for the leaks later um so let's just uh kind of show what he's got um in terms of animations because we haven't uh really done that um so first of all skill two okay i, I guess i should start with the skill one though um this is the skill one okay so skill one and then it does taunt right then the skill 2 applies on the left and right, okay? And then it gives him the damage increase. And it, ap it applies on the person too. I didn't know that. I thought it was only left and right. So if I hit this one, just to make sure. Left and right? Oh, wow. Okay. Um, I don't know if he has skip animations. I like it. I do like it. Um, so that's Fuego's animations. Now let's uh okay so let's let's leave this now and let's check out his base stats because I think that is actually quite important uh quite important right um so he is a dark attacker okay we've already been over his kit if you want to check out the should you summon you go do that um but now we could check out his stats so what I'm going to do is check out the dupe zero, then dupe five, and then go up to 10, uh, 125. So right now, um, his stats are pretty weak in terms of magic attack. Now, I could pull it up right here for you guys. Um, if we check it out, his magic attack stats right now are around, like, okay, let me, let me go to attackers, are at the very low, low, low side of this, right? We could see they're very low right now, um, but... But then, uh, oh, okay, hold on, hold on. But, um, if we just check it out at dupe 5, it goes up to 13,200, which 13,200 is right in between these two. And Fuego is basically in the range of all the burn units. Okay, you could see burn, 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 burn. And this was beginning a game, so it makes sense. So, you could see that uh, Fuego has very high stats. Okay, if we're just comparing it to like other D magic attack units, higher magic attack and then higher attack, I believe. Uh, a, a bit lower attack, but he has a bit higher magic attack, bit lower attack, which I mean is very, very good in my eyes. Okay, being at that range is going to allow for a lot. So you could see if you slot like... Depending on what your magic attack on Julius says, you could expect like a bit higher. Okay, a bit higher. Um, now, besides that, we could see that his crit rate goes up to 35, which um, I just want to see Black Divider's max base crit rate. So his max base crit rate is 29. So Fuego has 5% higher. Um, now, you're not really going to be building full crit. You're going to go for mainly magic attack because he has burns and he has all attack uh, percent increase in his kit, okay? So due to that, you're still going to want to go for uh, magic attack, but that's going to be something a bit more tested if anyone finds crit rate to be better, you know, obviously. But you could also see he has, uh, I think, does he have the highest HP of any DPS? Um... Yes, he does, because everyone is at 54k or below, and he's at 54,500, which is great for building him with HP as one of the substats. And then, not even just that, his defense is also in the higher realms, right? He has the second highest defense, but not as high as Black Dividers, okay? Um, oh, wait, yeah, Black Divider, I guess 45,000, probably miss input. So, yeah, um, that's good. That's really good. That is really good. Um, and then obviously the big final thing that matters. Also, wait, what is what is Black Divider's crit damage? Because 40% base crit damage seems very okay. No, it's low then. I guess it's low. All right. So yeah, I don't know about building Fuego crit. You could put a bit of crit. Like you could go the order. Um, in my eyes, with thir with 35% crit, with 35% crit, right? The order in my eyes 
um, is obviously magic attack. And then I'd go accuracy. And then probably crit rate, crit or HP. Crit or HP. That's like the third set. And then it would be either HP defense, right? That That's kind of how I would go for it. Um, like the first two magic attack accuracy. And then obviously, especially for like low spending, you're not going to have like exactly the choice, right? So you could go for either crit HP and then HP defense. Like the last three substats are between crit HP and defense. Okay. That's how I would go for it. Okay. Because you're going to mainly be doing a lot of burn damage, especially because he has three on his combo, right? So um, that's the important part, right? Keep that in mind. Um, now we can get to the kind of important thing. He has 103 speed. He's a 103 speed unit, which works well with Summer Vanessa. So for sure, he was meant to be used as a, uh, if the quickest, uh, sorry, if the slowest unit on the team get protection, okay? Because Summer Vanessa will easily be able to get over this even at level 100. You just put four speed on Summer Vanessa and then you're going to be over it. And then at max dupe, this is what he's looking like. He's going to be at 110k HP. Uh, does his magic attack stats do go up so he's gonna be at 14600 105 speed okay um so his stats are looking oh wait my bad he's gonna be at 15,000 magic attack 103k sorry 113 113k hp base so you could probably get him to about 130k hp with uh hp substats okay um and then 105 speed is doable like summer vanessa even at level 100 can beat this which is the good thing okay he was for sure meant to be slow so what you're going to be doing is probably targeting um vanessa first uh green vanessa and then you're going to target black divider is kind of how it's going to be working okay um now this is my fuego we've already went over his kit so there's no point in doing that but this is the fuego that i'm going to just showcase off in this video um i'm still going to use the team i would have so it's going to be noel and then it's going to be uh dorothy which, yeah, we'll, we'll use, we'll put Dorothy, and then it's going to be, uh, well, Fuego, Vanessa, and then, yeah. So, I'm not going to use Magna. I kind of wanted to try it out, but we'll, we'll have fun with Dorothy since she just came out. So, yeah, it's out for a month, and so basically, all these passives, everyone shares, okay? Oh, they all share them. They have different gear, though, and different talents. But, like, for example, when you're above 90% uh, HP, everyone gets a 50% all attack. Below 10%, everyone gets 100% uh, all attack increase. They take 400% less damage from red units. And then when they hit us with bleed and burn on, they get ammo for three turns. Okay. Um, and then also, um, what is this one? I'm forgetting. I'm really forgetting. The top one is, it's translating, is they apply ammo block. Okay. So, basically... Um, I, I don't know if he tried it or not. I don't know if Ali tried it, but we're going to be going in with this, uh, I'd say. So we'll, we'll try with this. Obviously, we should have Fuego in there. Um, this is what I think we're going to try with. Because, hmm, we could do, uh, we could do this. We could do this. Uh, yeah, we'll, we'll do this. And then Noel and the, uh, Vanessa for slot, because it doesn't really matter. I don't think it matters. So, um, let's go into this, okay? I just want to have a little test of what his damage is going to look like. Now, Dorothy is very poorly built in terms of accuracy because it's Ali's account. Um, so, what, what debuff did Dorothy get? Attack lower. Oh, yeah, okay. So, there we go. That's that in motion. Um, so, they're not going to apply burn to us just yet, which means we have a chance here. So, they're going to apply bleed, okay? That's obvious. Um, now we could see Fuego has the two turn immortality right there. And if he, we were attacking with burn, actually, we would have been hitting all of them. So we see that like they do damage. I don't think I'm like going to kill them. Probably it's more so just going to be to show how it works. So we got to start getting rid of them. Uh, so like the, this is the crazy thing. They all have like 400 K HP. So I just wanted to kind of have a testing ground, okay? Um, so Fuego still has ammo for a, like two turns and then he's gonna re-get it because he does have the skill page. Um, so what I'm gonna do is apply three burns on Mario, I think. Or we could go for someone. I think Yami is who needs to go or Charlotte. She has the mark. So we'll just, uh, we'll put this on Charlotte. 
okay so speed lower and three burns three burns very strong and now we can silence so we are gonna silence um okay and then i could put this so you see almost the full heal oh wait we can't attack okay so we're gonna go for this um and then next turn we're still taunted but we're gonna go for this they're gonna get immortality i just want to test out damage so now there's three burns on the uh, charlotte and we're gonna start applying the counter so that that is that is uh pretty good i feel like fuego could solo te these types of things but the thing is they're gonna get immortality right so that that is the hard part um i'm gonna retry this with someone who blocks the ot to see how much better it is um but then uh, yeah so that's gonna be the main thing we're gonna retry this with uh someone else but now we could use this and it's gonna put three so now we see we're pretty back up right um we didn't get a full heal oh maybe we did but the burns took us down i wasn't uh, looking at that but we should be able to maybe kill no very close though so the burns are not gonna kill okay um but okay we don't have salamanders we oh now we got salamanders playing okay all right all right all right um so we're gonna apply this we'll put this on yami um okay i think if we have dlt block this one should be doable do we have mo for one turn left oh, okay so yeah damage wise it's looking a bit more poor now but he's gonna counter counter right it, it's gonna be pretty good it's just i don't are we gonna live i mean that would be pretty funny we see it going pretty well for this right like they also have 400 khp so we got to consider that but this is like kind of funny though what are we gonna win just by default of burn no we're not oh maybe maybe one more counter and i think we're good oh no but it wasn't aoe oh oh the burns took us down so it's oh when we attack we get the heal though right so we should get it now yeah full heal huge and then we ah not enough waves okay um honestly though if we consider it um that that hey fuego practically almost solo that way counters which i wanted to show in this video at least the pve viability um so now we're gonna put who do we want to put i uh, will put ghost we'll put ghost instead of dorothy i think or ghost instead of uh yeah we don't need the protection the protection is kind of hurting us in pve right now so let me just swap vanessa's gear over i guess uh i had four speed but i don't think it matters um okay so 200k hp i mean i'll take it's good enough we'll just use our alt first turn and then uh they won't have immortality but then we'll have extra damage reduction which is the uh, important part okay um so we could also put fuego with uh no 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 we don't we don't need to though so we'll uh we'll do this he still has the rainbow so he's gonna get his immortality um with this we, we're also gonna get an all attack percent increase if i'm not mistaken so there's that to consider um okay so we have how many turns it doesn't show does it bro is it i hate that it, we can't see it so that's on it but there's not gonna be any burn which is five turns so that's the important part no burn right um all right that's that's fine that's good so okay we're gonna target uh who we're, i can't target mario we don't want to burn to be on us um okay i think we'll target char hmm or yami because yami soon is gonna start getting into his skill one territory so we're gonna we're gonna try targeting yami okay oh yeah, i was blocked but he doesn't have the passive it's true we're not in pve so yeah this is odds oh, uh okay so it's only gonna give him the damage increases but we'll take the accuracy i guess it's fine we do want to get that uh dot block um so now we are taunted so we're gonna apply this okay um and now we have an all attack increase so we're gonna be doing good burn damage right and we do counter on everyone right so if i start taunting everyone's gonna continue hitting me but like look at that it's it's good damage i would say i don't know about you guys but i'd say it's good damage um okay so let's uh and obviously this is the first stage i really hope the later ones are a bit harder but to me this is like decent content right um okay we could spread perfect and now we get a damage increase of no we could do this one we'll do this one even if it's the same all attack we get the damage increase and the skill two from sally one so we should maybe kill 
three burns. We have a 120% uh, damage increase. We're gonna, well, he's gonna die to burns, right? Okay, perfect. So now we got a, okay, perfect. I don't, that's, okay, good, 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 good. That did a lot of damage though, a lot of damage. Um, well, now we could put this, right? We'll put this on Charlotte since she's the closest. We want a buff to apply. Okay. Um, no, well, I'm going to use this one because the other one would be pretty pointless. Right. So we're going to we're gonna use this. Yeah, we'll use this. Okay. It doesn't really matter too much. Um, I think that's only one burn. It would be nice if they... Okay. So do we have DOT block? I don't want to give a memo. So we have no bleed okay but jack's about to apply it hmm so i'm gonna full heal probably i i should 126 i should full heal and then i i should be fine if i do this so yeah all right the 300k heal yeah yeah, yeah. okay all right perfect and then when i attack oh my god when you counter you heal too i forgot that's actually important when you counter you heal Oh my god. Okay. So yeah, he's gonna like PvE content, he's gonna be insane. Cause he's just healing every time he gets hit. Right? Every time he gets hit, he's healing. Wow. Okay. Um well let's do this and then we're gonna put three burns with Dorothy. And then does the does the like combo also heal him? No, no it doesn't. Okay. We gotta kill. We do have to kill. Um okay. I really hope we do. Okay, so that makes it a bit annoying. Having to kill in time when they have 400k HP. Please attack Fuego. No. Uh, I don't know if we're going to win. But yeah, I, I definitely think we... I showed what I wanted to personally. Oh man. Yeah, we're not going to win. But we could we could ult and just finish it off. Oh man. Okay, I'm not going to try it again. But like to me... With how many counters, but yeah, so that that is the problem. If we change Noel to like anyone, like anyone who gives damage or is a damage dealer, like if we put Magna also instead of Dorothy, you know, we'll we'll try with uh, Magna now because I feel like Magna is just a nasty person person to have, um, just because it applies the burn right away. So all the hits are gonna be uh, they're they're gonna count as. Hold on, let me let me find Magna. Where is my goat? Because all the hits are going to count as counters right away that we take because there's already a burn on them. Uh, Magna. Oh my god. Jeez. Alright. We're just going to build him defensively. We don't need him for anything else. So let's uh, let's take Dorothy's gear. Just put it on him. And then here we're going to put uh, this one. Okay. And then we're going to... Do we have just... I just want the defense ones. So this and then uh this okay perfect so let's go in with this i guess if not we could put me most i don't really think we need noel necessarily but we'll we'll keep her so this is just something i want to test to see how the counters react so uh this is important because now before we were not countering right away but now we should we should because we have the two-turn uh, Salamander, and there's a burn on everyone. So that's a counter. That's a counter right away. Okay. And then that's going to be a counter. Perfect. So two counters extra. Nice. I should put uh, Noel with the Magna, but I'm a bit lazy. You know, we're going to reset. I'm going to put Magna with Noel. So yeah, um, what we're going to do is, I think we're just going to stun Jack, because actually... Well, the, I don't really know, because I don't want to... We're, we're going to wait on the invulnerability, because none of them procced the uh, invuln. So we're just going to keep it like that. We don't need to stun. I want to get the counters in anyway. So that's one. Okay. Um, That's two. And then... Well, that's that's it. That's that's kind of it. But you can see, like, the, it does a good amount of damage extra on them, specifically. Um, Okay. So now we're going to put the damage reduction. Okay. Um, and then I'm going to start my stuff. So we're going to put this, I want to kill, ya uh, we're going to, we could also put this on Mario, but I think I'm going to just go for, uh, go for this. 
We just want to get... Because, look, he puts two extra burns, which is definitely going to help us. Um, So, yeah, we don't need to use the combo anymore. The burn damage sure is good, but I, let's see if we could do it with this. Maybe a magic attack magna is going to be needed, but I'm not entirely sure yet. So, uh, okay, I need to start using my skill one with Fuego to do the counters, right? Um, okay, so he has two burns. All right, so we'll put this on Jack then. Oh, he has stun block, but that, that's fine. More burns. Okay, and there we go. Bop, yep. So now we could do this. We'll do it on him. Yep. Stun? No. Okay, so we don't have... Uh, but it does make Magna quicker, I'm pretty sure. And we could do this. Okay, extra damage. Double all attack increase, even if only one works. Okay, um, I'm gonna taunt... Who? Who do I even want to? I'm trying to think. Uh, so I need to taunt someone. I think taunting is gonna be better. Do I have Salamanders up? For how many? One turn, though. So I might need to taunt her just to be able to get... He only has a skill one. Yeah, okay. So we're going to do this. It really doesn't do much damage, the skill one, I find. Obviously, we're against, like, tanky-ass units, but still. Oh, Fuego died this time. He didn't have... Uh... Okay. I Because I didn't really use this skill too much. All right. Well, um, I mean, we had fun testing with them. This is, like, an early just kind of look into this, right? I definitely think we could see Fuego has potential in, like, PvE. But it's obviously the units around them that I got to match a bit better. But, like, I, I don't know. We showed some different instances of how, like, uh, the counter worked and all that. And his damage for, like, those type of PvE contents is going to be good. But it also shows how frame challenge is going to be pretty annoying. But, yeah, I think with frame challenge, my goal is going to be to complete it all with Fuego. But we'll see if that's possible. That's that's going to be what I'm looking forward to. But, yeah, um, I definitely think some of his damage is lacking. Like, the skill 1 damage, I feel, could be higher. But we'll we'll see in the future, right? Um, how he works, right? Um, I think with um, Mimosa, he might also have some viability in PVE because she keeps on applying the magic attack increase with this, which is going to be definitely good multiplicatively. So we'll we'll see how that looks um, with the all attack I'm, I'm talking about. But that's basically it for an early Fuego showcase. I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you for watching. Bye bye.